Okay, Storm and I spent about an hour and got it all put together. Got stands in the front. This came in three pieces. One, two, three. I got the hitch also. Had to put the belts on and the motor on. Got the adjustment bolt for the belt tension. Two bolts come down and screw up into the bottom of the motor. Plate there. Tension it up and good to go. So I just got to put oil in it and gas. Yeah, so we'll get it going. Okay, I used the old uh, super split to fill this entire log lift bag. Equal to one face cord. And I know it's pretty accurate because I had this side of the pallets stacked four foot high all the way down. And um, yeah, it was most, mostly uh, slab wood like you see on the top there. But there were some rounds and it is full full so i had looked at i had considered an easton made ultra uh, for my next high speed splitter um, i was thinking really hard that direction but there was like a year and a half lead time on those and i wanted it this this summer rather than you know next winter um so i ordered this super split in uh i think it was the first of march 
of 2023. And then I got it the third week of June here in 2023. So these still have like 16 week lead time. So uh, don't expect to buy it and get it the next day or a week later or even a month later. However, so far, I've been very happy with it. It, uh, it splits, splits really nice. So you'll be seeing more of these. If you have watched Ohio Woodburner at all, Joe there, uh, you know he loves his super split. And that was one of the reasons that I considered the super split. So I got the super split. Uh, this is the HD model. So there are two 90 pound flywheels tucked in there. And then there's more bearings on the bottom here. More bearings for it to ride on the I-beam. So just a little bit heavier duty and I plan to use the crap out of it. So until next time, be safe brothers and sisters.